Hi, I'm Preston DeGuise. In this short video, I'll show you how to use the updated protection policy controls in PowerProtect Data Manager 19.8 to add replication to an existing policy. So let's get started by launching our browser and logging in to Data Manager. To edit a policy, expand protection and choose protection policies from the left hand menu. Then select the policy you want to change and click the edit button. You can see here we've got a policy that only generates a primary copy to a data domain called Neutronium. I'll edit the objectives to add in a replication option. When I click edit I can adjust the objectives for the policy. I'll click the replicate option to configure replication for this policy. I then click Add to add the replication configuration. This brings up a dialog where I can choose which data domain I want to replicate to and the replication process. I'll configure daily replication with the copies kept for 14 days and save that when I'm done. I then click Save and because there's nothing else I want to change with that policy, I click through the remaining edit options until I can finish the configuration. Data Manager now tells me the policy has been changed, so I'll click View Details just to see the Jobs view. The Jobs view will show the background configuration in process and a new DR backup of the Data Manager configuration running. And that's it. Thanks for watching the video and be sure to check out the blog for more details.